Hi, my name is Mike Johnson. I'm taking you on an inside and outside video tour and test drive of this 2017 Toyota RAV4 Hybrid XLE four-wheel drive premium with the advanced technology package. We're gonna go in and take a look and check the tech, take a test drive. The last three digits of the VIN number are, gotta put my glasses on here. 611 so this was built in February of 2017 making it about one year old so the Toyota RAV4 the the hybrid version was new for 2016 and this is a 17 it's much faster than the old v6 version or the gas version let's do it Start your stopwatch at three, two, one, go. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 miles an hour. When I said 50, you should have stopped your stopwatch. It's very quick. Um, very strong acceleration because the electric drive system is working in parallel with a gasoline drive system. So quite a bit of horsepower. And not on only that, you also have your uh, anti-collision features. There's a dynamic radar cruise control system. So if I turn on my cruise on my display here, it says radar ready. And then when we get ready to turn around, we do have a front camera for pedestrian detection and avoidance. Toyota calls this new system Toyota Safety Sense P. That's what they're calling the technology package features. And then with that, you also get the much better uh, radar uh, cruise control than they had in years past. Let's pull over here and we'll get behind somebody and we'll accelerate forward and engage the cruise control. So I'm gonna accelerate up. Full speed, set my cruise, and I'm bumping my cruise desired speed to 50 miles an hour, yet we're only going about 35 miles an hour. No feet on the pedals. I'm ready to hit the brake as needed, but with the car is driving itself, this little button on the left side of the steering wheel is, can I can close up the distance the distance and I'm still not touching the pedals but right now I'm going to go for max distance and then when the vehicle in front of me applies the brakes this RAV4 will apply its brakes automatically to slow us down and we're slowing down a little bit but we're going about 38 stay behind this car here it's applying brakes we're now we're braking Car's automatically braking, 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 and it says, okay, now I have to take over. So it has an anti-collision feature. The biggest advantage of that is when you're sitting in traffic all day long at speeds over 20 miles an hour, you don't have to touch the gas, you don't have to touch the brake, you just set the cruise control and it will follow the car in front of you. You can set the desired speed at 70, 75, 78, and it will maintain the following distance that's safe if you happen to be driving in the afternoon or morning when the sun glares in your eyes the cars in front of you may suddenly be braking and you yourself might not even realize it but the radar system will react instantaneously and possibly save you from a front-end collision and the fact that it's reacting faster than you hum than you can as a human being can also reduce the chance of a rear-end collision as well so it really can improve the safety of the vehicle and it also can probably get you some discounts from your insurance company let's go talk about the more of the tech on the inside let's pull over so I've pulled into the shade here to continue to check the tech on this RAV4 and I'm going to explain some more features so new for 2016 and newer you have steering wheel controls to operate your on-screen menus and your 
radio controls are on the left side. So on the on-screen menu, we have also got lane departure warning system. So when you're driving straight in your lane, two little guidelines appear on your screen letting you know, hey, we're good, we're in your, your lane correctly. This part of the technology package on this RAV4, it also has parking assist. So parking assist system in the little menu there, if you can see that right here, it's parking assist blind spot monitor radar first talk about the parking assist so this will help you back into a parking space it'll even steer the steering wheel for you so if you're not a very good driver this might be a good learning vehicle because the parking assist can help you ascertain when you engage it'll alert you when you have a parking space big enough now let's go outside and take a look at the outside for a second so as we go outside, parking assist feature adds these parking sonar sensors to the various corners of the vehicle. There's quite a few actually. You'll notice the obvious one when you look at the photos right here down here by the fog light. But also in the front bumper you've got parking sonars there. So you've got four front sensors and then you have these sonar sensors on the rear bumper as well down here on the black part. Sonar sensors there. So when you're close to objects, it'll alert you and it'll help you uh, steer itself into a various types of parking spaces without crashing. So the parking assist is very nice. Now it also has the blind spot monitor system. See, I just turned on See the little on-screen menu here. Lane departure alert turned on, steering assist active. And so we also have the blind spot monitor. So in the mirror here, there's a little LED indicator, which if there's a, a blind spot, person in the blind spot, that light comes on and it works when you're driving. It works when you're backing up out of a parking space. So let's go talk about blind spot monitor in a minute before we get out to save time. I want to keep this video going rapid pace here so I'm going to show you the features of the car and this little button here is your lane departure warning system so when I press that it lets you know lane departure alert turned on so it'll give you those all the lane lines it's using the front camera up here in the overhead console to make sure you're okay in your lane this one also has the navigation with the live traffic so you see on the freeway, we have our green stripes on the side of the freeway as I zoom out. It'll give me a much larger idea of the traffic. So when you're planning a trip through the city, you can just uh, punch it in there and you see all your traffic conditions. Green, everything is green right now. Not a bad day to go jump on the freeway right now. So we're going on an outside walk around and then we're going to go inside and talk about the tech. So this is a 2017 RAV4 hybrid, four wheel drive, AKA all wheel drive, perfect for the snow. The hybrid is faster than the regular version because it's got a lot more to pull it forward quick. It's got, this one has got the advanced technology package. So we're going to talk about that now. It also has a power tilt and slide sunroof, AKA moonroof up on the top, which you can open fully and stick your head out in parades and things like that. It's got the roof rack crossbars. Let's get up close and take a look at this vehicle. So as we get up close here, you'll notice there's parking sonar sensors on the front bumper. There's four in the front, four in the rear. One, two, three, and four. So this will help you in your parking skills. If you're not that good at parking or maneuvering, this will help you out. It's only 9,000 miles on this, so the tires are still like brand new. And the rims and tires look excellent. Plenty of tread on the tires. Very clean body. The rims, the tires. 
On the rear, we have parking sonar as well in the black area. You got four sensors on the back, plus your backup camera right here. Color backup camera, and the backup camera has moving guidelines to alert you so you can maneuver into a parking space. Everything to help you drive on this car. Now the technology is called Safety Sense P. Here's your all-wheel drive. So let's talk about the safety equipment, then we're gonna go inside and talk about all-wheel drive. First of all, up on the windshield, you have a front-mounted camera system. So that front camera works with your automatic dimming high beams, so you can drive around with high beams all, all the time, and it'll automatically go to low beams when other cars are around. That's a nice feature. But that front camera can detect pedestrians at night and work with the pre-collision avoidance system to help you not crash. That also works with the lane keeping system and this has the, so there's actually a front radar unit right here in the front of the vehicle. That's a millimeter wave radar unit looking forward about 500 feet in front of the vehicle and as you're driving on cruise control, it'll lock in on the car in front, match speeds, really helps you out. On the rear, it has millimeter wave radar in the rear. Now that's hidden in the quarter area of the rear bumper. So there's a radar unit on each side, left and right, scanning 180 degree field of view, actually more than that. So when a car is sitting here driving in your blind spot on the freeway, either side, left or right, a warning indicator will come on on your mirror this little indicator right there that's your blind spot warning alerts you somebody's driving in your blind spot if you turn on the turn signal it'll start flashing rapidly and that lets you and the other driver know that you're turning with someone in your blind spot or planning to change lanes the blind spot does more it has rear cross traffic alert with pedestrian detection as well so let's explain that so i'm in a kind of semi-blind let's let's this is the back of a business but let's call it a busy street here you have cars whizzing by when you're backing up if a vehicle is approaching at about 90 feet distance speeds up to 40 miles an hour you're going to get a warning of the approaching vehicles on your rear cross traffic alert system so that you don't back up in front of them and get into an accident that's the blind spot uh, rear, I'm sorry, rear cross traffic alerting system. That's different than the bumper sonar sensor. That works at distances up to 90 feet for the rear cross traffic alert. You know, and if there's a pedestrian within about 25 feet, it'll alert you as well when pedestrians, and you know to go check your backup camera really well. If there was a big lifted pickup truck parked on each side of you, you couldn't see anything from the driver's seat but the backup camera will help you and the rear cross traffic alert will help you to back out of a parking space. All these safety features are really nice. Now let's go inside before the video gets too long. One of the features you get with the XLE package is a power opening rear hatch. So you got a little button right there. I just press it and the rear lift gate opens or closes. So if you drop your kids off school, at school or something, somebody needs to get in the back, you can hit the button from the driver's seat. If you jumped in and you forgot to close it, just hit the button. Now, the interior of the XLE comes in cloth. If you want leather, I can have genuine custom leather installed for you. It's an additional cost to you of $1,200. And that's for top of the line. The retail price of the leather is $2,000. But we can get it done for you for $1,200 if you want that done. Uh, my, I will provide a video explaining about Caskin leather interiors. I have an authorized Caskin dealer which will install the leather for you. And if you prefer cloth, you have cloth. If you prefer leather, it's $1,200 more. And that's a big deal because the RAV4 XLE doesn't come with leather and the RAV4 Limited doesn't come with leather either. Leather's actually not available from Toyota on the RAV4. Maybe it has to do something with uh, keeping the vegetarian crowd happy or uh, using recycled materials or whatever it is. On the Limited and the SE model, they'll offer you Softex interior. 
but that's not leather it's just it's fake leather but what I'm talking about is putting real genuine leather interior in here and you can even custom order certain patterns but we recommend the factory match and um, that's what we recommend let's see the uh, power sunroof it's tilt up tilt down power open and then you have a sunglass holder you've got visors with light they can turn sideways and extend out the front windows are lightly tinted on this vehicle this is from Arizona in California you can now have tinted windows on the front windows if you get a note from your doctor that's a new law for 2018 they let you have tinted windows in California now first they passed the marijuana law now they passed the yes you can have tinted windows on your front windows if your doctor gives you a note so I guess the same doctors that give uh, marijuana prescriptions now can give tinted window prescriptions interesting how that works but let's look in the glove box and see what we have here we have all the various books and manuals for this in a nice packet it's got two keys with this vehicle and it's got all kinds of features built into the radio. I'm gonna talk about the radio next. So we're talking about the radio, beginning with the fact that this has the Bluetooth streaming music. Let's turn it off so we don't get any sound from the AC. So you notice I have my music playing on my radio and the same music is appearing on the screen actually looks better on the car screen than it does on my iPhone you can fast forward to the next song or stroll through depending what you want to listen to you can fast forward your songs you can do it from the phone but you can also do it from the steering wheel controls so I can just scan through till I find the songs that I want to play and it will import the cover art I can control my volume from the steering wheel. It works very clear. Go to the next song. And then you can play your music. Turn that down. I don't know what kind of music you like, but it works very well. So you have Bluetooth streaming music. There's no wires connected. They even give you a place to set your phone right here on the that's in a console here so it also will play podcasts or uh, internet streaming music I have on my phone I have some iHeart music so I can get internet radio where you can't get regular radio it also has built-in satellite radio as well so if you prefer to listen to satellite radio you have that here and then it has an app suite which will work with your phone called Entune. So Toyota has an Entune app. If you install it on your phone, you can have all sorts of additional apps here on the radio. Quite a few maintenance messages, phone traffic, eco, all sorts of things. Your navigation is full feature, premium navigation with live traffic information. I had previously mentioned freeways are looking good right now it's a good time to hop on the freeway I don't think it's gonna look like that on Friday afternoon but right now it is a good time talking about the Bluetooth on the radio it also has a Bluetooth phone oh speaking of Bluetooth phone we have an incoming call let's take that call so we took the call we're gonna continue on talking about the Bluetooth streaming the biggest thing you need to know is in a lot of states it's now illegal to hold your phone for any reason you can't hold it for navigating you can't hold it for making calls you can't hold it for texting if the cops see you with the phone in your hand they can give you a ticket so this will pull in your call history like the call we just had that was a private call but your phone calls from your spouse and everything will populate right in here into your dial pad here so when your wife or husband or spouse or boss or children call 
you just touch on the screen and select their number and then it dials it hands free just quick touch on the screen that's all legal you can do that it works perfectly well and with the anti-distraction safety features on this vehicle you should be good to go 9,780 miles on this car we're gonna wrap it up by looking under the hood and looking at the all-wheel drive and uh, talking about the body so we'll take a look under the hood this is very clean this is a hybrid system now Toyota gives you free oil changes for the first two years or 24,000 miles that's included two years or 24,000 miles free oil changes so that's good for another year or till it gets to 24,000 miles they'll do your oil changes for free for you it's the hybrid also comes with an eight-year 100,000 mile Toyota factory warranty zero deductible on the hybrid system and that's in addition to the basic bumper to bumper and powertrain bumper to bumper is three year 36,000 miles powertrain is five year 60,000 miles hybrid is eight year 100,000 miles from the date the car was sold new it's a very clean car extremely clean this has the roof rack crossbars take a look at the roof you can see your nice big sunroof up there the windshield doesn't show any imperfections the front bumper rear bumper there's not really any visible imperfections of any kind of scratches or anything there's a little where there was a dent right there but uh, I think that's gone this side here there isn't any physical damage on it at this time but it did definitely have a scratch here that was fixed by the previous owner or the insurance company it's very difficult to tell we did scan it with paint measuring equipment and looked at it very closely so it did have some paint work done you know that parking assist system is good to help you if you don't know how to drive but still people can scratch up their cars um, so this side was scratched and repaired by the previous owner's insurance that gets you a little bit of a discount on it I mean these hybrids can be 33,000 uh, for the XLE package so you're coming in quite a bit cheaper so if you have questions about it or you want to see more let's get the camera real close here take a look at it I didn't find any overspray or anything you've got all your labels here on the pillar no overspray anywhere overspray is like when they paint something and then it over sprays onto adjacent panels it's very clean so this was done by a very professional person but it was uh, paintwork right here just on this left side just disclosing that to you because you're not here you're on your computer watching this video but the wheels look great I already showed those two wheels let's take a look at these two wheels I don't see any signs of uh, any noticeable uh, curbing little tiny mark right there tire tread is excellent rear tire looks really good and now we're gonna peek in at the all-wheel drive mechanism get my camera in the right position so let's wrap up this video my name is Mike Johnson you can give me a call call me direct on my land number 951-681-2101 this car this RAV4 SUV is available for sale as of March 8th 2018 give me a call 951-681-2101